The College of Agriculture, Food and Rural Enterprise is providing support to farm businesses through a suite of schemes under the Northern Ireland Rural Development Programme 2014 to 2020. These are part funded by the European Agricultural Fund for Rural Development. The schemes are business development groups, farm family key skills, farm innovation visits and technology demonstration farms. Business Development Groups, or BDGs, have been in operation since 2016 and there are over 140 groups in operation across the main farm enterprises. Groups of like-minded farmers meet six times a year for training events on topics agreed by the group. Events are mainly held on members' farms and include presentations, demonstrations and skills training. Discussion is facilitated by a dedicated advisor, however, farmers learning from each other is an important aspect of the scheme. Uh, David Brown, Deputy President of the Ulster Farmers Union. Part of my reason for joining the Business Development Group, um, as a farmer, uh, we work quite a bit on our own, so therefore there is a social aspect to it, I suppose working alongside neighbours and other farmers who uh, have uh, obviously signed up to business development groups as well. But equally, I suppose there's an opportunity there uh, to learn from one another because as we travel around each other's farms, uh, the discussion that takes place, um, while uh, there's obviously a topic to be followed uh, and, and a reason for the meeting, uh, I think similarly when we get into discussion with uh, other farmers, we get an opportunity to learn from each other. Benefits of BDG scheme membership include support from a CAFRI advisor who can help with preparation of a business plan for your farm. Through training events, farmers can keep up to date with technology and these events are also an opportunity to meet other local farmers with similar interests who are facing similar challenges. Hi, my name's Philip White. Uh, I farm here at just outside Port de Nome with my wife and children. Um, I run a flock of uh, sheep here and uh, just under 100. Uh, I work out full time and I also have some uh, uh, samatal uh, cows uh, through to sell some stock off. Um, I joined the business development group in 2016 where I found it to be a, a great benefit for uh, efficiencies, um, learning all different aspects from going around different farms and, and picking up some, some new ideas. I also found that as I went on to do my benchmarking and stuff that uh, the business development group helped me quite a lot um, uh, to find out just where my, my heavy cost was and and find out uh, how you could improve on them. I would recommend joining the business development group uh, as I found it was very useful to, to myself, uh, both from the friendships I've gained, but also from the, the, the learning I've gained uh, and the efficiencies that have come out of it and uh, what have helped me over the years. BDG members are encouraged to avail of the whole farm benchmarking service provided by CAFRI. Benchmarking can help you know your performance, set targets and measure achievements. Benchmarking supports decision making and can help you face change with more confidence. Sean McCombie, Sucker to Beef, our Glass County Nine. I've only started the benchmark really since I got involved with the groups and it has actually wakened me up to see the potential achieved from our own cattle compared to those cattle that maybe we purchase. So going forward I see we'll probably be focusing on figures more so from that reason. The benchmarking aspect of it uh, has, has challenged us to look at uh, both the physical and financial performance of our farms and uh, that in itself is no bad thing because ultimately at the end of the day we're, we're uh, comparing our results from one year to the next and seeing areas where we can have improvement. Environmental farming BDGs are a new addition to the BDG scheme. Environmental farming BDG members will meet six times a year on each other's farms to be kept up to date with the latest technologies and strategies linked to environmental farming. Being part of an environmental farming BDG will help you farm with a dual emphasis on production and environmental outcomes. You will have the opportunity to develop an environmental plan for your farm, taking account of biodiversity, including pollinators, woodland management, carbon sequestration and nutrient management. Your plan will set out practical ways in which you can maximise the environmental benefits on your farm. Hi, my name is Anita Kirkpatrick. I uh, help my brother Alexander on my husband's farm or here at Rockburn County Fermanagh uh, along the edge of the Colbrook River. So the Colbrook River is an important habitat itself and by giving the, a better riparian zone it uh, increases that wildlife corridor for any of the, the species that uh, traverse it. 
and uh, just helps to protect it. So I believe that an environmental farming business development group would have been of a great benefit to us. Uh, as an example, with our agroforestry scheme here, we had to go through uh, a steep learning curve with uh, the choice of trees to make, uh, even the tree guards, what to get, what uh, where to source them from, and then on the ground uh, dealing with issues where uh, sheep were, for example, damaging them when we're having to double stake. So if uh, if you were part of a, a business development group where you're able to share that information and learn from other people, uh, you're not uh, right at the forefront there trying to fight your way through uh, with learning everything right from scratch. And I, I think that would be a real strong benefit uh, of an environmental farming business development group. The Farm Family Key Skills Scheme provides short training courses on topical issues impacting farm businesses. The courses are open to farmers, growers, farm family members and employees and are held in local venues across Northern Ireland. Courses typically last for two to three hours and there is no charge. In the past three years there have been some 330 courses on topics such as taxation, succession planning and the new digital VAT system. Feedback has been positive and, on average, 98% of participants have reported an improvement in awareness and knowledge. Courses to watch out for in the coming months include responsible use of antimicrobials, pig welfare, first aid awareness, coping with the pressures of farming and working safe online. Farm Innovation Visits is an exciting new scheme which gives farmers across all sectors the opportunity to gain first-hand experience of innovative agricultural approaches and technologies on leading European farms. There have already been visits to Germany, the Netherlands, Denmark and Belgium, as well as England, Scotland and Wales. Visits are led by a CAFRI advisor and the scheme covers the cost of travel outside of Northern Ireland and the cost of meals and accommodation while abroad. So my name is Samantha McCarl. I'm a dairy farmer from Fintona, County Tyrone. So FAV is a farm innovation visit. I heard about it through our BDG um, and applied, uh, filled out the application form, very simple application form, and got word that I was getting a free trip to the Netherlands to learn more about calf rearing. Just at a perfect time for us, we calve February to April. The trip was in March, so I come back uh, from the trip with a few new ideas and a few reminders of what we should be doing uh, during calving season. Yeah. So I would highly recommend applying for a farm innovation visit. The, the experience is brilliant. Once again, met so many uh, different farmers from Northern Ireland here that we still have a WhatsApp group, we still keep in touch if there's anything you know we think we can share with each other so we're still sharing knowledge um, it's, it's a great opportunity to get away and see farms and how it's done in Europe so I would highly recommend them. In the latest business support scheme to be introduced, CAFRI is establishing a network of technology demonstration farms. The purpose of technology demonstration farms is to share experience of innovative technologies with groups of visiting farmers, thereby increasing the rate of technology adoption on Northern Irish farms. The first four technology demonstration farms to be appointed were dairy farms demonstrating feed efficiency and mobility improvement. Further appointments are expected across the main farming sectors. For more information on the four business support schemes you have heard about, please visit the CAFRI website or get in touch by email, telephone or speaking to a CAFRI advisor.